Hi everyone, it's Jojo from Mojo Jojo Plans, and today I am planning some daily sheets for my daily planner that I use for social media. Um, I love these sheets because it just helps me narrow down everything in my brain. Otherwise, I get extremely stressed out because I have so much in my brain and I can't and it's hard for me to like pick like the priority things and then I get stressed out at the end of the day because I didn't get done what I really needed to get done. So this way I just like can see on paper, have down what I need to do and it just makes life a lot easier. Um, I want to continue with going in with some of the new sticker books from the fall release. So I pulled out um, seven of the next books and we're just going to go through each one of these. The goal is to do um, a book, a, uh, like a book, a spread, basically, for each page. I have two different pages here. These ones over here are from the Happy Planner. They are back and front. I only have two left. Um, so I have a total of four pages. And then these ones are from Live Love Posh. Um, and then I have three of these because they're only single day. So we'll kind of play with doing each one of these sheets. But let's go ahead and go in with this Live Love Posh sheet. I like put them in like a really random area and I'm going to start with Jewel Tone Jungle just because that was what was first on <laughs> on top of the pile. So this is size for a mini, but you know, we're going to make it work anyway. It has a lot of really fun stickers in it. This one's really fun. Okay, so first things first, I think I want to cover up this area over here with something. I don't know what just yet. But I am going to take some white out and kind of just white out this area. I think I'm actually going to try to white out all of the circle this time. Because I might put, there's a lot of fun like clear quote things. So maybe we can put one of those over to just cover it. So let's find something first to cover. So I have like things like this. So if I can find one that might be skinny enough. I kind of like this one. Okay. That one is the one I have my eye on because it's big. It'll like take up some space. Really, all I do is scribble in these so it doesn't need to be anything crazy. Um, but it looks like it's like skinny enough to not cover some of this stuff over here. So I think I might go with that. So let's try this one. Pull this out. And I'm going to lay it right in here. Never lose sight of your wild heart. And then we can stick some of the animals and all of that fun stuff in here, which I want to use them to cover up the bottom half because it's not my favorite. So let's use this guy. Let me cover up some of this over here. Um, and then I feel like I want to use one of these flowers since we're putting foil in here anyway might as well just go for it I'm gonna stick that right over there because I don't usually write too big to where it would I need that much space to write and I'm gonna cover up that spot keeping it pretty simple um, I'm gonna cover these up just so I can put some that match so I have focus on so we'll use that instead of priority the things I need to focus on and then um, then maybe we can just do important put this here like these things are still important but it's not like life or death if I don't get them done on that day okay we're getting there Keeping it simple. Use this little banner. It says be present in all things. Put that right down at the bottom. I think I want to put some boxes in there. Maybe we can use some of these on the boxes. So let me see what kind of boxes we have. We have a few. These ones say today, which I'm not mad at, so let's do this. I'm going to put some of these in here. Maybe do the yellow and the pink. Put a 
lay those in there. And then I'm going to go back to where those little banner decorations were, if I can find them. Of course, now I can't find them. They're there. Um, and I'm going to cover up the today, because I don't really care for that. Just like so. These are good for kind of just covering things up that you don't care about. And then maybe we can put one more cheetah. I think this is my only like pet peeve with things like this is we have cheetahs and then this is leopard print. So I'm just like, ah, we mixed our animals. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, I think, I think that's it from this book. I think I'm going to call it good. Kept it pretty simple, but that's all I need for the sheet. So I'm going to go ahead and flip that one over, done with Jewel Tone Jungle. The next one I had is Ingrid Blooms, and this is sized for a big. So this should kind of help me take up quite a bit of space, which I'm excited about. Ooh. We have these, and this is perfect for covering up those. I don't know what kind of color scheme I want to go with, though. Conflicted. I'm definitely conflicted. Well, maybe I'll just grab something and we'll just go with it. I think I'm going to grab this yellowy orange set, and I'm going to lay this in here. And just cover that up. Yes, we're covering up some other stuff, but that's okay. That is a-okay. I do have some really pretty florals, so maybe I can kind of do the same thing over here. Cover this whole section up. Because I don't really need it. And then I can take some flowers and stick it over there, if I can get them up. Kind of matches that one down at the bottom. Okie dokie. Okay, I kind of think I wanna do some shapes in here so I'm actually going to grab rainbow shapes and I'm feeling circles. I'm feeling like this is going to be a circle vibe. I don't know. So I want to use this giant yellow circle and don't ask me why. I was like going through and then thinking about it and I was like, I kind of want to do some circles. I kind of would like to do that. So let's grab a couple circles. I'm just going to put some down for some extra things. And then I have these, which I was like, maybe we can do something like around the circles with these. I think I'm going to have to, actually I kind of like it without shaping it to it. I don't think I need to shape it to it. So we can add some of those. And then I'm going to take Amber Plans Her Days, uh, Black Quotes 2. And I'm going to go to the end of the book and I'm going to grab a big quote to kind of pull this all together. Um, I like this dare to begin. If I can get it up. Dare to begin. Sticking kind of with that yellowy, splotchy vibe. Um, let's cover this up. And it says, love this. Why not? Go ahead and throw that in there. This one is definitely more kind of like decoration focused. It has a little bit of functional stuff, but it doesn't have a ton of functional things in here, which is totally okay. Kind of wondering if we throw this in here. I realize I just covered up all the bullet points, but I still have the lines, so I'm good. 
Again, I literally just scribble in here, so I'm not super worried about it. But I do like it. Simple. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, this one just has like a ton of decorative things, which I love. It's great for decorating. I don't think I want to use any more in here, though. Because I kind of already took up a lot of my space. So I think I'm going to call it good for that one. So using Ingrid Blooms. I like the shapes in here. Kind of brings it some color. So first two pages down. Let's go ahead and grab one of the Live Love Posh sheets for the next one. Okay, so the next sticker book I have is Happy and Hungry. I love this book. It has a lot of really cute things in it. Um, hot stuff enjoy every moment there's one sticker in here that i know i can't use because i'm just gonna have to hoard it um if you're a fruit you'd be my fine apple that's definitely one of them i don't remember which one it was but when i did my flip through of them i thought it was like the most hilarious sticker ever i don't know these are just so stinking cute <laughs> they're the cutest um maybe it's at like the very back or maybe it was the fine apple the fine apple one does crack me up it really does <laughs> I think yeah I think that one was it I just love that one so that one I'm probably gonna hoard for a hot minute okay I want to kind of figure out a way to use these dang like those odd shapes are really hard for me to use like I don't know if y'all noticed but I never use them same thing with these like tombstone they're just really hard for me to use I think this is just going to be one of those spreads where there's just like food all over the place. I don't really have anything big enough that I can turn sideways because these ones both have a saying on it. But I do have lots of colors, so maybe if I can take a box, I guess I can kind of just choose a random color because I have lots of colors in here. Um, let's go with blue. I'm going to go with blue. Then I'm going to choose a big blue box. And not necessarily cover it, but kind of just add to this box to add some color into it. So I'm not covering it. I'm just adding another box to kind of make it a little bit more fun. Um, yeah, these sheets are so hard for me. So this should be... <laughs> This should be interesting, but maybe we can do, oh my gosh, I don't know. I'm conflicted now. These sheets just make me so angry, <laughs> but I'm like, I'm running out. Like these are like all I have. So I kind of have to suck it up and use them. I literally don't have any other sheets right now. Um, and then after this week, like I'll only have some of these sheets and then I'm completely out. So I either need to go to the store and get some more or, um, you know, I gotta suck it up. I just, these ones are just so hard for me to use. I don't know why. It's just like a different layout that I'm not used to, I guess cracking under the pressure of this layout. <laughs> um, okay, I'm going to just kind of start adding some of these little stickers in there. And then I think I might try to do like a big quote. I already have a feeling this one's not going to be my favorite. Even though I love this book, I think this book is just going to be hard to use in here. I think that's all it is. This one's hard to use in this page on this page not in this page okay well, let's grab some of this fruit we're kind of making our own collage I'm not impressed with this one you guys I'm not gonna lie not gonna lie not feeling it we'll see if we can redeem it <laughs> uh, it's not going well it's not going well at all I don't really want to okay where'd those one I'm determined to use these dang things. I'm going to do these for the extra things that I usually note in here. Maybe if I stick a giant quote in here, I can save it with like a really big quote. 
So I'm going to go to Amber's original one and I'm going to put a giant quote in here and just see. Let's do this find a way. That sounds pretty accurate for how I'm feeling right now. I need to find a way to make this one work. We're going to cover that up a little bit. Yeah, this one's not my favorite. This one has just gone oh so wrong. <laughs> Nothing sweeter. Well, sure. <laughs> you know, these, it's just these sheets, they're so hard for me to use and to be willing to use. I love this book. I just, I think on a daily sheet, it's just not happening. It's not happening <laughs> whatsoever. And it's okay. I'm just going to let it go. We're just going to add a few more. And you know what? I'm going to end up scribbling in this page anyway. So it is what it is. But I think I'm going to leave this one alone. <laughs> okay, I gave up on this one. This one has just like gone downhill. That one went downhill fast. Let's try to redeem ourselves with um, another one of these pages. I think like just this layout is just really hard to decorate. Unless you have giant stickers. And that book does not have giant stickers in it. So let's see if we can redeem ourselves with gold and black. Um, on this sheet. I think there's some bigger. Like yeah there's some more like decorative things going on in this book. I just think that one was just not. It wasn't a good time. <laughs> I'm going to use the gold foil stickers. Because I know I won't. I'll be less likely to use them in my classic planner. So I'm going to use them in here. Just kind of stick some of these in here. I do want to look for some boxes. I like this all black one. Purpose fuels passion. I feel like I need to layer that on something. Feel the need to layer. Feeling a strong urge. I already have a lot of that going on. I think it's just this sheet, you guys. <laughs> uh, I don't think I've ever like felt that much failure <laughs> in a spread before. I'm like I feel like usually I could pull through, but I just think those particular stickers in that layout just were not helping each other out at all so it's okay we're gonna make it work I'm gonna make this one work because now I'm determined to I have a lot of there's some functional stickers in here that I'm kind of looking for right now um so I'm trying to find those we do have priority and important, so let's go ahead and put those in. These are my priority. These are still important things to get done, just not the only things we have to get done. Ooh, I like this fake glitter look. Hmm, reminds me of something coming fairly soon really pretty do do let's do this rest and relax <laughs> okay 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 I'm gonna go back to that this stuff and try to fill in some space uh do I do a big black quote I feel like big black quote is like number one way to take up some unwanted space <laughs> Let's radiate positivity on this struggle bus of a spread. It's just this layout, you guys. I don't know how I'm going to do a whole week of only using these sheets. I might lose it. <laughs> it's fine. If I mix some of these in with the gold, kind of break it up a little bit. And I can put a little bit more in a few spots. But maybe if I break it up with some of those 
these like dash dot things. It'll help. Okay, Daffy. Let's get like one more to put over here. I'm trying to choose ones that are a little bit different. Okay, I'm starting to, oh, spoke too soon. I'm starting to feel a little bit better. I'm feeling better. I'm starting to like this one more. Now that we're really focusing on embracing the gold and black, I'm starting to feel a lot better about this page. Uh, it's just like this layout takes effort <laughs> to try to fix it. That's all it is, is this one just takes more effort than I was wanting to give. Because, like, they're just my daily sheets. I use them. I haven't thrown any away yet, and I don't know if I will. But it's also one of those things where, like, I scribble them. They don't look cute anymore. So, you know. Okay, we're going to call that one good before I ruin it. But I like this one more now. We took up more space. I'm feeling a little bit better. <laughs> Let's go back to the happy planner sheet. And I have, oops, that almost fell on the floor, a graceful heart. And this one has hollow stickers, which I absolutely love. But I hoard them. So it's one day I want to do like an all hollow, like nothing else. And I know I'm going to hate myself for doing that. So, like, part of me is like, I want to save all the hollow stickers for that day when I'm finally like, let's do an all hollow, like every sticker in there can only be in there if it's hollow. I want to do it, but I'm also like trying to take a picture of that is going to be a nightmare and I'm going to hate myself for it <laughs> when it's time to like take the picture of it. So, uh, that one I'm like, mm. but I do want to do that. Maybe, uh, next year, uh, 2023 I'm planning to have a project planner um more so like in the sense that it's going to be a project planner that I do like challenges in uh like spread challenges it'll be like for my patrons like oh let's have this challenge and do this type of spread because sometimes like there's certain things I want to try but I don't necessarily want them in my planner planner I don't know if that makes sense and then maybe at the end of the year it could be something where like it just has like all these random spreads in it, but then I can like give the spreads away or something along those lines. So I don't know, something I was thinking about, but then I'm feeling like, I feel like if I did it in a planner that wasn't necessarily the planner that I use all the time, like there's a lot of different challenges I want to do. I just haven't done them yet because I either had like a plan for a spread that I'm doing in my own planner and so it didn't make sense to do it in that planner or something along those lines. So, but it is something I want to try in the future. Okay, I guess this is going to be a pinky vibe spread because that's the stuff I'm grabbing. <laughs> what did I just do to myself? I feel like I need black in here. I need black bad. Do what brings you joy. Put that right up at the top here. Do what brings you joy. Something to cover that up. Um, I'm going to take one of these little pieces. Oops. If I can get it off my finger. It says to do. I don't think there's any big circles in here. This one doesn't have a lot of decorations. It has a lot of really great functional stuff, but it's definitely not a decorative book. So this one is a little hard to use on its own. This one is definitely a combine it with something else that's super colorful. But that's not what I have out today, so we're going to make it work. If anything, I might add a black quote to kind of just calm down all the color. But I'm kind of having trouble figuring out what I can put in here. Maybe we can just turn this into a square, and then maybe I can stick a small quote in there. So let me see. Let me see. Well, I have this, so I'm kind of like, might as well use it. 
have that little sheet. Kind of just wanting to get some black in here, but maybe if I can find a small enough quote that can go in a square, I'll stick a square up there. So let's just go ahead and do it. We're sticking with the pink, I guess, because that's just what I pulled out. I'm gonna cover up the circle and turn it into a square. We can do girl power. Let's go for girl power. Girl power. <laughs> okay, let me see. I have some, some of these pages have a little bit of the like little black decoration. So I'm just gonna use some of these to kind of break up some of some of the pink because it's a lot. It's definitely a lot of pink. So let's just use this whole page kind of add in here. Break up a little bit of the pink. Or at least make the pink pop. If we're going to do it, then might as well add in some black. And then we just got rid of some pages. So this is my main book of Black Quotes 1. It's getting thinner and thinner, and this is like my backup of it. So it's getting pretty thin. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's go ahead and flip this one over. I'm going to move on to another book just because this one doesn't have a ton of decorative things in it. And let's do Funky Abstract. This one has a lot of really big stickers in it, so I'm excited. I have hope. Finally, I have some hope in this one. All right, we're going to go with Silver Foil. I'm going to cover up this box thing down here because I don't need it. I don't want it. Get out of here. Maybe we can pull some green out. Lay that down and let's see pull these splashes and kind of put them in some spots get some color in here can change these because we have them oh we had a top three that would have been good too that's okay and um, we'll do remember as like the other things that I do need to get done on top of everything else and then let's add this dark blue we have some silver splotches Like this, it's a lovely life. Throw that in there. And then I kind of want to just cover up over there. So I got to figure out what I would like to cover that up. I feel like I should do a few more splotches in here. Man, I haven't needed my X Acto knife this whole time. Till now. Got so far without it. <laughs> um, let's see there's another there's like some of these black pieces that we can kind of add in some little abstract pieces I just decorate the rest of that page I want to say there weren't any circle at least not big circles in here. There's some smaller ones, but definitely not anything to cover that up. So maybe we'll just do a long box quote. I like this one. We're all a work in progress. All right. Yeah, then I have lots of room to write and that's good. Okay. Where did I put the other sheets? Oh, I guess they're over there. Okay, I have one more. One more of this dang sheet that I need to get used to using because it's about to be all I have. I'm going to go in with Feels Like Sunshine. And we're going to hope we can get this feeling like sunshine. Now, this one is definitely focused more on 
um, you know, self-care, all that good stuff, which I did get the planner for this for 2023, and I'm really excited to use it. I probably won't do stickers in it, um, but I am really actually excited to use that planner because I'm really bad at doing, like, check-ins with myself and just, ugh, like, I'm really bad at it. I need to be better. So I'm super excited to use that book. Breathe in positivity and out negativity. I'm trying not to think too hard about what I'm doing right now. Because I think when I start to think too hard on this page, then I don't like it. So we're just not going to think. We're going to go. There aren't a lot of decorative elements in this book though so that is something to kind of keep in mind there's not a lot going for it as far as decorative elements but we're gonna do what we can with what we have in here Let's see what i can get just going for it trying not to think about it Follow your heart. That's what I'm trying to do right now. <laughs> uh, don't stress. Oop, as I drop it, that just caused me stress. I'm going to title that part, Don't Stress. <laughs> uh, I want a quote. I want a quote. I kind of want more black, though. Not going to lie. I need more black in here. So, we use one of these encouraging quotes like, the struggle is part of the story. Stick that in there. Get some of those. Okay, I think I pretty much used most of the decoration things that we have. So we have some fun little rainbows. I'm going to throw in some spots. Put some of those in here. I don't know, there's not a lot of decorative elements for this book, so kind of making it work with what I've got. Um, I do have a focus sticker, so that's good. Things I'm focusing on. have some longer strips of this so why not I'm actually liking it it's simple <laughs> but it's definitely better than the other one so I'll take it I will definitely take it Yeah, I'm really excited to use that planner. Uh, let's see. I feel like I could put one of these focus things. Let's put this sticker in here. I feel like this would be good. A check in with yourself. You can start doing what that planner is supposed to do now. <laughs> Stress management. We're going to figure it out and it'll be okay. Okay, I think that's it for that one. Oh, we got there. It was a struggle, but we got through. So I think this one's actually my favorite. I'm excited for this one. Okay, so here's one and then two. I think this one's my second favorite. Three, four. Oh, actually, this one's my second favorite. Maybe this is my first favorite. I don't know. Four five <laughs> six I do like this one and then seven just keeping it simple <laughs> they're not all my favorite but it's okay you know we got to try things to learn if we like things or not um but there we go you guys I still hope you enjoyed this video if you did please make sure to give a thumbs up and subscribe and I hope I'll see you in my next one bye